Hey guys, Yanni from Filter Gray Hair, and today we are going to talk about how to import music and font into InShot. There are basically two ways to do this. The first way is to use AirDrop to send file from your Mac to your iPhone. Choose my iPhone here, and I'm gonna choose InShot on my iPhone, and it has been successfully imported to InShot. So we're gonna go to music. You can click to preview, and I'm gonna use the first one. Now you can trim your music, adjust the volume, and even add the fade in and fade out effect to it. You can also split the music into two parts or remove it if you don't like it. The second way is to share files from other apps. Like Dropbox or Files, I'm using Files. I'm gonna find the music in my files, choose Share, and open it in InShot. And there it is. You can do exactly the same thing if you wanna import fonts in InShot. However, you can only import one file at one time. Because the iPhone just couldn't recognize all the files at the same time. So now I have my gloss and blue font in my InShot. Let's try type filter gray here. I've imported other fonts before, and don't forget you can always change the color and add animations to your text. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.